FNN. Headline News Update. Good afternoon, folks. Steve Rhodes coming to you live from the shores of sunny Delray Beach, Florida. This year, 2 p.m. update. And currently, I still have that mixed bag out here. That mixed bag shows the Dow is the only indice trading to the downside. It's off 60 points. The S&P's up 7. NASDAQ 72, 92 now to the upside. The Russell's up 19. The semis are up 22. The trendy's up 134. Uh, the Dow just went positive. We've got the uh, Fed's uh, minutes uh, that uh, have just been released out here. So we're going to see some type of market behavior. But what we can do here, as as opposed to just watch the play-by-play -play market behavior, is let's just go take a look at the cash indice charts out there. Because each of them are signaling that the market should rally. Why is that? Because if we take a look at the Dow, there's an A to B equals CD to the downside. You can see on Monday, you form that bull sash candle. That confirmed that uh, buy pattern out here, price above its oscillator and change line. That's a, just a rally, a rally where back to the 32755 level. If you look at the S&P 500, this formed a nice bull sash candle on Monday. That also confirmed it's A to B equals CD pattern. As long as price remains above its oscillator and change line, price should rally up into the 4100 area. The NDX 100 is the only one that needs a bullish reversal candle to confirm a buy the D point pattern. And you could easily get that bullish engulfing candle today. Plus, you want to see it close above its oscillator and change line, which is currently printed at 11816. The Russell 2000 has a wave seven pattern out there. Uh, seventh inning stretch. That's a courtesy of uh, the Chapman wave out there. That can be, and in this case here, is a bottom mean signal the semiconductor index this formed a by the D point pattern, we had that rising window, that gap to the upside. That was a couple of weeks ago. So she has a bottoming signal. In the case of the Dow transports out here, they have confirmed a buy the D point pattern. They did that when they generated a bullish engulfing candle on Monday. Now it needs to get above its oscillator and change line. So the key level there to be watching is 13,834. If it doesn't get above that, then a bottom is somewhat suspect. The NASDAQ composite, this will confirm a Rhodes momentum indicator bottom if we get a bullish reversal candle today. Right now, that's what we have. New York Stock Exchange, that confirmed a Rhodes momentum indicator bottom on Friday. Yeah, did that on Friday out there. And so you've got bottom signals all over the place. We've got a bottom signal. If we take a look at the New York Stock Exchange, the top 100 international stocks, they formed a nice Rhodes momentum indicator bottom signal, as did the um, U.S. top 100 inside the New York Stock Exchange. So everything is set, folks. We should rally from here Let's see how the day plays out. Have a wonderful Wonderful. Wednesday. I'll be back with you at 1 o'clock sharp on Terrific Thursday. Take care.